Hello, students. Uh, let us see this question of section C from IIT Jam 2024. So in this question, they have given you a Jenner diode circuit and the power rating of Jenner diode is 10 volt and 2 watt. And also a normal diode is also connected across this Jenner diode with, which have which require 0 0.7 volts to conduct. Now in the question, we are asked to calculate uh, V load that is voltage across this two kilo ohm. So if you want to find the voltage across this and two kilo ohm register, we, we need to find how much load current is flowing here. So let us calculate that load current. So in this question, we have total four possibilities. Okay, uh, the first possibility is that both Jenner and normal diodes are off. Okay, but that is not possible because even if we say this diode is not conducting and we remove this from the circuit, at least this diode will conduct, normal diode will conduct because this requires only 0 0.7 volt. And here we are applying 20 volts. So obviously this diode will be in forward bias, it will conduct. So the first case that both diodes are off is not correct. Second possibility is that uh, Gina diode is on and normal diode is off. If I say Gina diode is on, then obviously the voltage across this inner diode will be 10 volt. And again, this 10 volt is again sufficient to con to make this normal diode conduct. Okay, so this 10 volt across this inner diode will also means when it is on, this diode is also forward bias. So this is also not possible. If Gina diode is on, this will be also on. Now, the next possibility is that I say normal diode is on and this is off. Okay, so let us say this only this is normal diode is conducting and I'll find the how much load current is flowing in the circuit. If I say this diode is only conducting, then this is off. So there will be no current flowing here. So all the current will flow across these three, three resistance. So the load current will be 20 minus 0 0.7 divided by total resistance 3.5 kilo ohm. This will give me 5.5 milliampere. And if I now try to calculate voltage across these, uh, across this Gina diode, so the total voltage will be 0 0.7 volt. And then there is a three kilo ohm resistance. Current flowing is 5.5 milliampere. This gives me 17.5, 7.2 volts. Again, the voltage across Gina diode is 7.2 volt, whether while the Gina diode require only 10 volts. So this, will, this is also conducting. Okay, so the third case that this is on, this is off, this is also false. So only the possibility is that both the both the normal diode and Gino diodes are conducting. Okay, and now uh, the the last case is correct. So this 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 will be wrong. This calculation will be wrong. Now the exact value of current will be flowing in the circuit will be given by this because this is a 10 volt now. This 10 volt will be equal to uh, current voltage across this three kilo ohm and 0 0.7 volt. So now I can find the load current 10 here voltage 10 minus 0 0.7 divided by this three kilo ohm. The current comes 3.1 milliampere. And now I know the current I can I can find the V load across this two kilo ohm 2 into 3.1 milliampere. And this gives me the 6.2 volt and 6.2 volt is the correct answer for this question. Hope you understand the uh, question. Thank you very much. Milte hain ek aur problem ke saath.